everybody, welcome back to another video. And today we are going to read The Purple Kangaroo by uh, Michael Lan Black and Peter Brown. I wonder why it's called The Purple Kangaroo. The Purple Kangaroo. All right, let me get to it. All right. Hey kid, guess what? I've got a super secret, highly unusual, incredible, and amazing magical power. I can read minds. It's true. In fact, I can read your mind. There must be someone behind the lemonade stand. Because, like, lemonade stands cannot talk. <laughs> yeah, it's a monkey. I want you to close your eyes and think of something. What kind of something? Something spectacular. I want you to think of something so spectacular that nobody has ever thought of it in the entire history of thinking about things. Huh. Interesting. Let me see. Mm, I got it. I got my... I got it. Got it? Great. Now say what it is out loud. Don't worry, I can't hear you on just a picture in a book. I was thinking about a pink universe. The whole entire universe was pink. Yes, perfect. I wonder why it's called the paper kangaroo though. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> okay, and now, drum roll please. Da -da 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 and now I will use my super secret, highly unusual, incredible, amazing, and slightly alarming magical powers. I like to say that fast because it's just better saying it fast. <laughs> Look into my eyes, look deep into my eyes. Concentrate. Wait, I see something is becoming clearer, clearer. Got it. Okay, let me look into the eyes of this picture book. <laughs> okay, I think you got it. You guys look at it now. I'll give you 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. All right, he got it. He got what we're thinking about. You're thinking about purple kangaroo. Oh, that's why it's called purple kangaroo. Makes sense. No, you weren't thinking about purple kangaroo. That's strange. See, he thinks he's not a real mind reader. He is a liar. You're not a real one. Do you mean to tell me that you weren't thinking about Purple Kangaroo looking for his best friend, a wild-eyed chinchilla named Senor Ernesto de Pantalones? This is, that was very hard to say. <laughs> no, I was not thinking about that monkey. While wearing roller skates? Nope, I wasn't even thinking about Purple Kangaroo. So, in the course of his search, the purple kangaroo, whose name I would like you to now provide. Oh, I can name the purple kangaroo! Okay, let me think, let me think. Um, in the picture, it looks like he's a boy. So, I'm going to name him... Huh, Sam. This is Sam the purple kangaroo. All right, let me restart. So, in the course of his name, I mean search... <laughs> This purple kangaroo, Sam, didn't find five, five fra fragrant bananas? I'm not even thinking about a purple kangaroo, so please just get to a different subject. Which he then juggled while blowing an enormous rhyme ball bubblegum bubble out of his nose? Huh. Interesting. Hmm. <laughs> And that a crowd of exciting onlookers upon seeing this astounding trink did shower Sam with gold coins? I'm telling you, dude, I'm not thinking about a purple kangaroo. So get up the subject of it. Which he then used to hire a giant paisley blimp, thus furthering his search for his very best friend, the eyed, the wild-eyed chinchilla, Senor Ernesto de Pantalones. That's so hard to say for me. <laughs> Have you seen Ernesto? Says the little blimp. And that while aboard the blimp, he didn't entertain the pilot, Admiral Margot Hittita. I can't say this. I'm just gonna call her Captain. 
This is Captain. Actually, no. Captain Pilot. Pilot Captain. Pilot. Pilot Margaret. Yeah, okay. You have to answer time the pilot. Uh, the pi the pi the pi the pilot um uh, Margaret with feet of hula hooping during do during do during on the moon. Okay, I think I've, I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna think of something else now. I'm gonna think about this right here, this little monkey um, right there <laughs> because it's really weird. Are you really going to sit there and tell me that you weren't thinking about a banana juggling, roller skating, hula hooping, rainbow bubble gum nose blowing, paisley pattern, blimp floating, wild eye chinchilla, senor Ernesto de pantalones searching, purple kangaroo. Well, guess what? <laughs> that was so much to say. I really want to say it again. <laughs> I'm going to say it again because I like saying it again. So this time, you, I want you guys to, to try and listen to see what I say because I'm going to try and say this faster. So down in the comments below, tell me what I said. Three, two. There you go. Banana juggling, wool skating, hula hooping, rainbow bubblegum nose blowing, paisley pattern, blimp floating, wild eye chinchilla, senor Ernesto de pantalones, touching pea, purple, unicorn. I mean, kangaroo. <laughs> I said unicorn! I said purple unicorn. That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> purple unicorn. It's not a kangaroo, it's a purple unicorn. Now I'm thinking about purple unicorn. Okay, I'm thinking about purple unicorn. That's my final thing for this mind reader. Well, guess what? You're thinking of one now. No, I'm not. I'm thinking about a purple unicorn. A purple unicorn. Purple, purple, purple unicorn. You put the na 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 ba. Purple unicorn with rainbow. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, you're thinking of one now. See, I told you I could read your mind. In fact, that's so good. I bet you can go back to the start of the book. I could do it again. Well, you didn't trick me, Mr. Monkey Man. So he lost. I am the winner. <laughs> so, guys, see you guys next time. Bye!